Casinos are the lifeblood of Las Vegas. That's why they have some of the best security in the world. But thieves are figuring out how to beat the system. So security leaders are trying to employ the very latest technology to stay one step ahead. That's what they're talking about at a three-day expo going on here this week. Calvert Collins explains the new tactics. She's live on the Strip. Calvert. Well, Gary, all the talk was about high-definition cameras. The better the quality, the better a surveillance operator can see someone who's trying to count cards, maybe steal some poker chips, or even uh, the license plate of a wanted man. It's about protecting the casino and its customers. As long as casinos have been around, so have thieves and cheats trying to rip them off. There's a lot of people coming in. They might want to do some unscrupulous things. Who doesn't remember Anthony Carlio, the 29-year-old who stole $1.5 million in chips from a Bellagio craps table in December of 2010. Then he ran through the lobby in a motorcycle helmet. You have some of your biggest cheats trying to come here and score big. So it's extremely important that not only can you see what they're doing at the tables, but you want to know where those people go after that. Mitch Fagundis works for Ericont Vision, which makes this 180 degree panoramic camera with 20 megapixels. That's 10 times more than HD TVs. Nevada law requires casino cameras to capture 30 images per second, but not very many in our casinos are in HD. Surveillance manager Carl Couch from Wind River Casino in Redding, California, wants to upgrade their 472 cameras ASAP. Because we are currently uh, analog, we need to get switched over before it gets too late in our system, and that'll cost us twice as much to get caught up. The clearer pictures are leading to arrests outside the casinos. This gentleman here is actually doing an illegal tow out of one of the out of one of the casinos here on the strip. Zoom in a little. Just for about seven frames. Yep. We get that plate. Now, security cameras range in price from about $100 for the least expensive analog cameras all the way up to several thousand for those panoramic ones. And coming up at 6 o'clock, we're going to talk to a Canadian company whose software does facial recognition and can see a high roller walk in the front door of a casino, even a car implicated in an Amber Alert. Reporting live, Calvert Collins, 8 News Now.